Ryan Gosling. <laughs> I turned 30. Congratulations. Thanks. Uh, you don't legally have to move to New York when you turn 30, though. You just felt like a change? Well, everybody told me that I would feel different, and I just didn't. So I thought, <laughs> I'll do something different. So you feel different. So I feel different. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Name a celebrity you had a crush on growing up. Raquel Welch. OK. Fill in the sentence. I like to blank in the nude. <laughs> Undress. It's a nice suit. You look good. You look sharp. <laughs> Thank you. I feel a little self-conscious about it. Now, no, why? Well, because I already wore it once. <laughs> you wore it once. I mean, that really was hilarious. You were laughing through a lot of the show. You know, I have this weird disorder where when I find something funny, I laugh. <laughs> you laugh at it. I want to get into the movie in just a bit, but first, I understand the girl-to-boy ratio in your house is now three to one? Yes. How's that going? It's heaven. It's like, it's like walking through a field of flowers every day. Just, well, congratulations. I live, I live with angels. Uh, so, you say you're from Westminster? Or is that a nice town? I like... <laughs> I like your suit. Do they make it for men? <laughs> All right, I'll go with you, no, Morrison. No, I agree. You're, you're my man. Just you're my man today. Get out of the way. Thank you. Do you guys need help with the cameras? Can I? <laughs> well, okay, so don't judge me. Okay. But you know how when you eat something weird, your brain sends your tongue to investigate? <laughs> no, but listen. What uh, physical feature of yours do you like the most? My left thumb. <laughs> it's so much better than my right I thumb. I was going to say that. So nice having you here. <laughs> Have you been to a taping of this show before? Once. Oh. No. <laughs> I think Mr. Gosling had a line for you. Go ahead. What's the strangest thing you're afraid of? Loose hair. <laughs> Loose hair. Yeah, just like, you know, like just one. Like, like somewhere, like a, yeah, like, like you have beautiful hair, but if just one of those were to just wander over here, <laughs> it would give me pause. <laughs> 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 now, let me ask you another question. Is that like a free suit from a movie, or did you actually buy that one? No, that, this is free. That's why I want to wear it. Right. <laughs> right, right. And, uh, yeah. See mine? I'm, uh, yeah. See yours, Young Men's Shop. <laughs> <laughs> if you owned a boat, what name would you choose for it? The uh, SS Nausea. <laughs> <laughs> you get seasick? Not a fan. Oh, okay. <laughs> And there is a dystopian atmosphere, but there is also a triumph of the human spirit. Okay. I'm invested. All right. What can you add to that? Is there a mic I can drop? <laughs> <laughs> My bobblehead is anatomically correct. Shut your big mouth. <laughs> What's your favorite children's book to read to your kids? The Grapes of Wrath. <laughs> it's a nice short story. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Yeah. They probably go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, it was her first time in New York, and I, 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 I brought her to the window in the morning, and I, I, I said, uh, you know, you know, sweetheart, welcome to New York. And uh, two cars went, smash! <laughs> But my parents were like, this guy can't watch movies, you know? He, he, yeah. he, they have too much of an effect on him. So I could only watch uh, Bible movies and, uh, and National Geographic movies. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so the, so like, then the next week, I came to school, and I hit a kid in the neck with a blow dart. Wow. <laughs> That's not true. That's not true. That's a joke. Yeah. And handed them uh, several boxes of Girl Scout cookies, and then drove off. And as 
you drove off, Daniel said, I think that was Ryan Gosling. And his wife said, yeah, I think that was Ryan Gosling. So was that Ryan Gosling? <laughs>